Hey guys, I'm going to do an update. We're going to test a theory that I've got. The theory that I've got is that if you've got a tarantula that's moody or supposed to be docile, but it seems to always attack, you know, it seems pretty aggressive, that if you change the enclosure, you can change his attitude, okay? It's just a theory. I haven't done this. I haven't tried this before, so I may get bit because we're going to try to hold one that has always been mean that should be a pretty docile species. My G. rosea, um, if you've seen some of my past uh, videos, uh, Big Meanie, it's the most aggressive uh, tea that I got. It, was, it bites everything that goes in the enclosure, okay? I've changed his enclosure, or her enclosure. I've changed her enclosure. She's been in this new one, I'd say probably two months. And I'm going to test the theory that, that, uh, that it's her attitude's changed. And the reason I think this is I put her in this new enclosure, and she doesn't seem to be as aggressive as she has been. She doesn't eat as much as she did, but if you've seen my past videos, man, she was she bit everything that got near her. Okay, so let's take a look, and let's try this. Okay, show down here. I got my son kind of videoing. We're going to scoot back a little bit. Um, I don't want it too close. Anyway, so I have never held her. I haven't tried this, and this may, no go, may not go, and she may bite me. I've never been bit before, so if she does, it'll be my first. But uh, I really like to try this theory and the only way to try it is to, to give it a shot. So first I'm going to test her temperament because if she starts biting the straw obviously I'm not going to hold her. Now if you've watched my past video, she would ever let me touch her like this. Okay? Remember all the other ones in the past, if I put anything near her she would just freak out and bite it, never let go, just chew on the straw, big huge uh, teeth marks in it. So I'm going to try to coax her out. Make sure my hand's not sweaty. I'm kind of nervous. My hands are starting to sweat. And I've seen her in, in action. So this is making me nervous. But, but it's all good. It's all for, all for good fun here. So here's Big Meanie, being held for the first time, okay? So I'm not saying my theory is correct, but I've never ever held this spider. And I've always been afraid of holding this spider because her attitude is always so bad. She's always biting everything. Every time I touched her, put a straw in there or anything, she would just attack it. Biting into it is just crazy. So this spider really was uh, pretty mean, pretty aggressive. So here we are. She's being calm. She's not biting. So my theory is, is that if you've got a spider like a, a rose hair um, that's usually docile, um, change it, and it's not. It's always biting, always being aggressive. Change her enclosure. Not saying that maybe she likes the enclosure too much and just doesn't like anybody going in it. Maybe that's the reason she's always biting, okay? Maybe it's not. But if you want a docile species and she's not being docile and she's being aggressive and mean, change her enclosure. See if that will change her attitude. Because if you go back and look at some of my old videos, you'll see how mean the spider was, okay? And you can see now there's no aggression. Easy to hold. I mean, obviously, I didn't leave her in my hand too long but enough to prove a point. I could never have done that before, ever. Would I have ever been able to do that in her other enclosure? So there you go. I'm not saying I'm correct, but I promise you that was the same spider. If you go back and look at Big Meanie, that's the same spider. I just put her in a smaller enclosure. She wasn't that big 10 gallon uh, enclosure. And, and I, I changed it because I'm, I'm breeding my other one, my Rosa. And so I got her out of there, got this one out of there. I don't want anything in there that'll disturb Rosa. I want her to have, you know, Billy do the egg sac and, and don't want her to destroy it. So I try to make it so she, uh, so she's not being disturbed. So I put her in this one. It's been about two months. And as you can tell, her attitude's completely different. She's a lot more docile. So, so give that a try and uh, 
Let me know what you guys come up with. See if you guys are experiencing the same thing. All right? Okay. Appreciate everybody for watching and subscribing. Love you guys.